Yo, what's up guys? It's Brick. Just come at you guys on this video today. I'm going to be doing a video that I'm going to be showing you guys um, all the C4 spots, turbine spots, and shock charger spots you can do on the map Newtown. <laughs> hmm. Excuse me. But, um, that was like a weird little sniffle thing. But, um, um, I did not come up with this, like, video idea. That was, this was not me. Um, my cousin, actually, his name is Colrox164, I'm pretty sure. Um, he did this. He did a couple videos on Black Ops 2 doing this. And I decided, hey, I don't have any videos that I need up. Um, I'm going to try to be more consistent, so I need to start thinking of more ideas. So, I kind of just, kind of just took inspiration from this. Um, kind of copying it. Sorry, dude. Um, but yeah, um, just, just so you guys know, that's who made this up. If you want to see like a couple in Black Ops 2 that are actually really good spots, go check out his channel. Link will be down in the description below. And hopefully I actually remember to do that. But anyway, so basically I'm going to be showing you guys all the um, C4 spots, trip mine spots, and shock charge spots that I found out on the map Nuketown. If you guys want me, to, if you guys like this and you guys want me to do some more maps, be sure you leave a comment down below saying what map you guys want to see next. Um... Or if you like it and you don't care what map I do, then also then leave that down in the comments as well. But let's I'm gonna stop wasting time. Let's just get right into this. Um, by the way, um, midway through the video, I'll probably switch up my class. So kind of like that. I might kill myself and do that. But um, anyway, back in this little area, there's not too, there's not, I don't think there's that really that many good spots. You could I mean put it up here, and they might not see it, but. You know, that's just an idea. It's pro they'll probably end up seeing it. Making me maybe a shock charge there, if you really wanted to. Um, it might work, but most likely not. Anyway, um, now into this like back area, it's really open, so there's not really any spots you can do. I know this is a really popular sniping spot, like right here. If you know someone's gonna be here and you just wanna do something, maybe you can place it here. That's probably a pretty obvious though. Mm, sorry. Maybe you can place a shock charge like in between here. That actually looks weird, but um, I don't know. They'll probably notice that too. So there's not too many spots here that you can really like hide it. If you guys know any, be sure to leave a comment down below. Not sure if this will like go into the bowl of fruit now. C4 will not be hidden, so yeah, it's not that good of a spot. Um, up here, this probably won't kill anyone up there. Um, over here, it's not too well. So basically. I'm gonna be going over this house over here, the middle area. Then I'm gonna go over the other house. So basically, starting off in the garage. Again, there's not too many little things you can place. I did find you can place a shock charge and a trip mine like behind this bicycle wheel. I'm not sure if it actually does anything. Like I tried to do this on with bots. I don't have anyone online that can help me test this. So I tried to do that with the, yeah, like it blew up, like the shock charge blew up and stuff. Just it didn't really like didn't do anything so that spot doesn't really work too well i don't think um might be able to do it like right here or maybe like kind of behind the bicycle maybe like right there i don't know um there's i don't know um actually a really good spot is probably up here just like if they're coming through this little area from here they're not gonna see it so unless yeah so if they pass right through they're gonna be they're gonna get shock charged but if they do go around and come through here they will see it so this is why that spot's kind of iffy it's not that good c4 also will work since it'll show you when c4 someone's near the c4 you can detonate like right here and it'll kill them anyway so i'm gonna grab that also if you guys don't know if you press x you can knife and if you press the left trigger you can inspect it and i have a rainbow combat knife right now same with the um fists you can't really inspect them but you can press x and they'll he'll slam them together kind of like the brass knuckles anyway uh just kind of gonna kind of move out here just a little bit it's kind of like the parking lot or whatever. i don't know like the entrance to the garage this car right here i might as well just mention this you can place a c4 right behind here um it's kind of tricky but if you can manage to get it no, that's not good or um if you can manage to get kind of behind the truck i mean the car kind of like that like no one's gonna really see that unless they're really looking for it so they're really not gonna see it and I'm not sure if it'll trigger, like if you see someone, like say you're running over here, you see someone right there, you can blow up the C4 and it will blow up the car. And that will kill them. So yeah, that's a good spot. If you guys want, I'll show you guys. It actually does blow up the car. You guys should believe me. But anyway, um, in here, um, this is a pretty clear wall right here. Um, right here is actually a decent spot. Like in these little plants, there's a lot of these in the houses. They're really good because you can just pass stuff right through it. And it's really good. Like a, a shock charge can go like right 
um, like right here. They might see it. They probably won't though, because they're gonna go like kind of like this, and then this is probably gonna trigger once they reach like around here, and it'll blow up. Or you can place a C4 right there, and when they go, it's gonna activate. You can press it, and it'll blow them up. Anyway, um, up to the onto the upstairs. Um, in this little chair here. This isn't really a good spot. It's not really that popular, but um, so yeah, it's not too well. I mean, you probably could hide a C4 right there. If you really wanted to oh maybe you can go under the seat i don't think they probably wouldn't expect that just because um, you can hide it kind of in the bars anyway uh, maybe behind the seat maybe Let's see. yeah you probably could figure out a way to get it behind the seat down here i was looking probably a perfect fit for a c4 just might look satisfying ah. okay something like that but it's really not that good but right here i'm not sure i was looking at this earlier i wasn't sure if you could like do this Kind of just stand right over it. Just kind of that. Oh, I got it right in the corner. They might see that. It probably won't though. So if they pass through this door, it's probably gonna, you know, not. It's probably not gonna blow up. It might blow up though. I don't know. Also, guys, there's also this weird glitch. As you guys can see, I am profit right. Now. I don't think you guys can see. You guys kind of see the shadow. But I am profit right now, and I have gravity spikes. It's a weird kind of little glitch, but yeah, it's kind of weird. Anyway, let's see if you can place anything behind these picture frames. Um, I don't think so. Maybe not. Maybe. Oh, look. It's that, it's that map. There's a lot of Easter eggs with that picture. Like, there's just, yeah, there's a lot of things with that picture. Also, but anyway, right there is also a decent spot. It would probably work better if you place it on this wall. It's harder to see. Um, maybe this wall. Like, for example, say you're sniping here, doing your thing. Um, I don't think anyone from that window over there, let's see if they can actually see it. So, I'm just going to kind of. Okay, that was, a, that was a bad jump. All right, I don't think, yeah, they're not going to be seeing that, so they can't, like, shoot it for their teammate unless they had, like, engineer or something and shot through the wall. They couldn't shoot that, um, but if you had, like, a trip mine there, for example, it would work a lot better because you could kind of just, some guy walks in, bang, they're they're dead. Also, right here is a decent spot because, yeah, I don't know, if they're, like, um, I don't know why that would be useful, but it, it's, I'm just showing you guys just there. Anyway, I'm going to grab my C4 so I don't run out. And then um, um, next, we're going to head over to the middle area. There's actually a couple interesting spots I found. Um, this might be a kind of a long video. Sorry, but, you know, I'm just going to try this out. If you guys don't like it, just leave down in the comments saying you don't like it. If you do, say you do. And, yeah, so down here in this little seat is actually a really good spot because you're not going to have too many people are jumping up on this car and, like, trying to go in it and stuff and looking inside. Like, even the only way you're going to see it is literally if you're here. As you're right up against the car, and even if that's the case, you're probably gonna be aiming down sights. It's gonna be really blurry, and not you're probably not gonna see it. And even if you really want to get it hidden, you can always put it right back there. Ooh, let's get a better. I'm pretty sure you can get it like down where the pedals would be. Even here, you can't see it. Here, you can't see it. Here, you can't see it. So that's a really good spot, and it will blow up the car. So if there's anyone here kind of messing with you, kind of, because I know this is a really popular spot. Pretty sure there's a hard point here. You can place a C4 right there and blow it up and it'll blow up this car. It's one of the more useful spots in this video just because this is such a high traffic area. Anyway, another part, it's just right here, you can place C4s under this bus. Kind of at the perfect angle. Oh, there you go. So, as you guys can see, you're not going to be really seeing that. You're not going to be looking for it. You're going to be looking forward. You're just going to see a little black thing right there. And you're not going to be looking. They're going to come through. They're, you can blow it up as soon as it's armed. Say so you're doing, like, your thing right here i am you're doing your thing and they come through and you go bang you can just blow it up or if you want to be even more sneaky you can always go in this little corner oh wrong bud you can go in this little corner so that you know they don't see it until they come around that corner because if you're coming right through here you're not going to be seeing that c4 until here and even then you're going to be sprinting past it trying to do something or you're going to be aiming down sights right here and you're not going to be seeing that uh, C4 right there, and then the guy over here is be like, oh dang, look at that guy, bang, and just get a free kill, and it's going to be nice, um, and yeah, uh, also this bus you can place stuff under, um, it's kind of, it's a little bit more tricky because it's like, it's really small, and it's really kind of, yeah, I tried this for a while, and I couldn't really get it, I think I got it once, I didn't kill the person, so yeah, it's really, really tricky, so, 
Yeah, I wouldn't even. I'm not even sure if it's gonna work too well. It's probably not even worth it. I know you can also place it down in these little the, down there like that. I don't think it kills anyone though. Like you'd have to place it really like on the edge or something. Um, and there's a bus right here. Um, I haven't really found too many spots that work too well. Maybe on the roof. That's what my little brother said. It's like try it on the roof. I mean, you're gonna be able to see that though, so it's not too good unless they're not paying attention. That might be a decent spot. Um, right here, if the, if you get if you spawn here. Like on this side, and you come through the bus and you just like cover or something. These guys aren't gonna see it. They kill you. They're gonna run past. They're not gonna see it unless they go like this. But yeah, they're probably just gonna run past, cover like probably something. They're probably gonna look a little something like this. You're shooting. You're shooting. The guy over is probably gonna be in this garage trying to take cover and stuff. He's gonna shoot you, kill you. So you come here, take some cover. Still not gonna be able to see that C4 run through here probably trying to get to here get covered to take out like just kind of cover this house when he runs through like right here you can blow it up and it'll work you can also place a shock charge right there if you really want to just to make sure he dies i don't think it's worth it that much for one person um this car right here it's another pretty high traffic area i'm pretty sure the b flag is right like i think it's like right here or like maybe here actually no i think it's here because i remember taking cover or something anyway it's somewhere around here by this car Depending where you spawn, if you spawn on this side, you're gonna hide it like there. You wanna hide it there when they don't, when they're not out yet, which is highly unlikely. Or you could probably just hide it right here. Or like this mannequin probably won't be there for you, but you can kind of just take cover, get the B. Um, once that you do get it, you kind of just kind of just take cover here. Probably go prone so they don't see you. you hide it behind there. You start running, you die. It won't despawn. And I know that it won't, it won't despawn. It says losing B, you blow that up. The car blows up, and yeah, you kill the person that's right by B. So that's also a really, that's actually a pretty nice little spot right there because you can kill the person whoever's there. Also, I know we're only doing C4 right now, and it's already 12 minutes. But there's not too many. A lot of these spots will work for shock charges too. So I kind of use this as like kind of for all of them. I'm going over a little bit of shock charges, but um, yeah, again, most shock charges and reminds you guys are in a wall place place like kind of above doorway so your enemies can't see it like i'm almost sure yeah the, the guy in the other window is not gonna be seeing that but um unless they come through this window kill you then they're gonna see it and even then it's probably gonna get them anyway right up here and there it's another good spot um if you really want to be sneaky right there for a shock charge and also a lot of these will work with trip mines some of them do not work with trip mines but most of them do so just kind of keep that in mind do a little testing so another spot's here, it'll cover both door doorways, sorry. And yeah, it's pretty decent. Um, this backyard, not too many spots. Maybe, I think here will work decently. Um, maybe here, no, not there. But like there will also work decently if you really just wanna spawn trap someone or something like that. Again, above this doorway, like right on that vent right there. I wonder if we'll go inside the vent. little bit more I uh, won't do anything anyway um yep That's gold um I don't think there's really that many more spots in this garage right here um I tried like right here doesn't work too well like, just, like right under this stool thing doesn't work too well like it might if they don't catch it because like, I know this garage is pretty high traffic if you're in the garage I'd place something like I wouldn't place it like curved. That doesn't work too well. You want to kind of place it up really on the roof. And they probably won't see that. Or like maybe a C4 since it's more flat. Um, any more spots? This garage is pretty plain. So there's not too many spots. Anyway guys, again, keep in mind for shock charges. I mean, for trip mines. I'll go over trip mines really quick. Um, so, oh. so yeah, just keep that in mind really quick. Basically, trip mine's basically the same thing. Um, for ch shock charges, like up on those little things right there, like these plants, you can always place it right there. It'll probably jump out and probably get them, maybe, just maybe. But again, the best place is either right here because it'll kind of either cover, it'll cover most of, like right here. You will be able to see it from here. And if you place it right there, you will be able to see it from here. I'm not sure if there's any spot you could place it where they won't see it. Like if you can see the tip there see almost the whole thing there but yeah mainly maybe right here will work pretty good i'm not sure it might um another good spot uh right here again that's also a decent spot um right here maybe 
The sniper might be able to shoot it, but most likely not. I know the sniper will not be able to shoot this. For, like, if there's a sniper in the other window, they won't be able to shoot that, and they'll probably just jump out. It might... I'm not sure exactly how trip mines work. I'm pretty sure it'll just jump out and kind of like a bouncing Betty. Anyway, um, same with right here. Kind of just place it there. It'll cover you if you, the, the guy kills you and starts running past. Um, right here, it might not work as well. That's a more of a C4 spot only. Mm, here, not too many spots. Um, yeah, really not too many spots. You could try hiding in the fire if you really wanted to. That might work up here. Again, right on this little thing right here. Probably place it like right in the dirt, kind of like that. They probably won't notice that as soon as they walk in. Um, uh, right here, maybe. I just barely looked at this and thought maybe this will work. Maybe not, though. Eh. Probably not. Oh, yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Um, oh, a C4 could actually be placed right here. Like under this little bed, maybe. Or, yeah, maybe, just maybe. Maybe right, I don't know. There's not too many spots for this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I tried placing a C4 on that chair, but I don't think that would blow up. Anyway, as you guys see, the car did blow up from just right there. So, like, right on the car, it would blow up. Anyway, guys, I'm um, sorry for how it was so long. I might shorten it up in editing, but, um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, you should leave, have a nice day. And also, don't forget to leave a comment asking what map you guys want to see next. And as always, don't forget to have a nice day. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.